Meh, see? Gonna give you some ticks and trips on the division, see? Meh! Right here. Meh, see? And it's not like the all gay three, see? Meh! No, I'm just joking. Um, I'm gonna show you guys how to survive in the dark zone today against one, two, three, four, five, however many people you may be fighting. Um, a lot of it comes down to using line of sight. Um, as you can see, I'm just jumping around and none of these guys are probably in opposite groups, but one thing to take into consideration when in the dark zone is that not everybody is in the same group. So you want to try to force people into shooting other players because people in the dark zone are greedy douchebags and they'll shoot every other player that is a rogue. Um, but aside from that little footnote, which is completely true, like that's not a joke, it sounded like one, but it's really true. Um, you want to force people into shooting other players. Um, but you want to lure people into positions that you know you can shoot them. Like for instance, right here, these guys chased me down this alleyway because they thought that I was actually trying to get away from them when that was not the case. Um, using line of, sight, line of sight becomes probably the biggest factor of survival in the Division of the Dark Zone, other than having you know proper gear stats, uh, with 65% armor being the maximum amount of armor you could have in the game. Uh, that just means it's going to mitigate 65% of weapon damage. If you want to apply that, I guess you could say, to a stat like health, for instance, um, that would just mean if you have 70k health, 65,000 points of that 70k health is your effective health, if that makes any sense. Uh, it would be 65% effective against damage. That's why I kind of keep my maximum health around 64 to 65k just because I don't really see a point in having it any higher when the armor cap is, you know, the 65% because that other little bit of health that you have that isn't covered by that armor is going to get melted. Um, another thing is don't fight people when they pop their ultimate. And when I say pop their ultimate, I mean survivor link because that's all everybody uses. It's really the only practical thing to use. Right there, this guy pops his ultimate and I'm just running circles around him. Um, he doesn't even seem to have any clue what's going on. Uh, I think he's using like an AR, and ARs aren't really the best gun for damage right now, I guess. Uh, maybe that's personal opinion. Somewhere, someone might be just tearing shit up with an AR. I just don't see it happening in the current state of the game. Um, but once that wears out, once again, you see all three of them just blindly following you into a little corridor. Uh, that's awesome, because that's when you know that they're garbage. Um, Right here, I'm running out the door, pop incendiaries. A lot of people don't want to take advantage of the, the, the special ammos, like grenades, the, the shot grenades, uh, incendiaries, uh, explosive rounds, stuff like that. Those are huge if you have them. That's why I always make it a point to stop and pick up all the little bags and stuff that I see on the ground, um, because those are obviously what contain the ammunition types. But as you can see, I'm always on the move. And that brings up shooting other players. However, I have no clue at what point in time it happened, but those guys went rogue. Meaning, not only am I getting all of their Dark Zone funds, I'm getting more Dark Zone funds than I would have before because they accidentally shot each other while trying to kill me. I was the whole entire sole cause of all of that happening. Um, I feel kind of bad for it just because a lot of these kids are probably poop, but it's whatever. Dark Zone funds are Dark Zone funds. Um, but the, the whole entire time I was in the fight, I was using line of sight, diving around, just just making people make mistakes. Uh, I feel like that that's probably the, the biggest factor in the game. Uh, for the most part, what you can see right here is just the, they're just out geared. Like, these guys have no clue what's happening. I probably am like a god to them because they're just dying so fast. Like, he died around the corner. I don't know what kind of Gumby stuff that was, but right here, this guy dies quicker than he even goes down, which is, that's all, that's always hilarious. Like, <laughs> people are just dropping like flies left and right. But um, I've said it like multiple times and it's probably annoying. Use line of sight. Like I swear that is the biggest thing in the division when it comes to survival. Uh, right here is kind of just like a little bonus clip because one of my friends was doing jumping jacks and for whatever reason he's like jumping around. I don't I don't even know what this is. <laughs> it looks hilarious. I wish I could just run around like that and shoot people. Um, but yeah, hopefully some of these uh, things that I mentioned in the video help you guys survive uh, a little bit more in the dark zone and not get robbed by players such as myself. Uh, if you enjoyed the video, stop by.